Hey folks, Father Sampati from City Virus here. Um, a very small tip for Canon Live users. Um, Canon Live, when you are using some, uh, you know, uh, transitions or effects, uh, when you are going to render it, uh, you can see that uh, in your CPU usage uh, will not be, you know, hundred percent. Uh, so for multi-core support, what you need to do in Canon Live is basically. Uh, you can see that we have lots of transition here so what we can do is basically go to the render and uh, I'm just uh, going to I'm going for some mp4 SM test uh, whatever and uh, go to the generate script okay uh, but, you know you need to you need to set up all of your files all of your setup here you know mp4 and then go to the generate script and I'm going to create a script here in desktop or here okay so just name it test dot sh here and press ok and it will be there now I'm going to my test dot sh here here it is on uh, the test dot sh in my document script so just right click and uh, open with any kind of editor and you can see that there are a lot of stuff going on but what we need is basically the parameter here so you can you can see it in here parameters okay parameters and here is real time minus one so minus one means you know uh, MLT will use uh, one core for your uh, render so what you need to do is basically I am using an 8 core processor so for safety i'm going for minus seven that means uh, seven core it will now use seven core and this thread thread is basically the encoder okay the encoder option and this real time is the decoder option okay so i'm just going to save it here so i'm going to tell you what this encoder and decoder means yeah in the render project you can see in this thread this thread is seven okay this is the encoder speed and in setting configure kit in live go to the environment you will see this one this thread okay don't go here for you know one two three four five six seven eight don't go over uh, one because it will uh, crash kit in live timeline uh, instead use this script uh, we used here okay and uh, just go for this real time seven or uh, whatever your threads are uh, for safety what you do what you should do is basically if you have four threads then go for three okay i have eight threads uh, sorry eight cores that's why i'm using seven okay now save it what will i save and now you can activate here from here start a script and it will give you okay it will give you 100 percent cpu usage so if you go to the system window you can see my resources okay that's how you can use your full cpu for rendering yep that's it thank you